Hello and welcome to my Gene Paralog guide for Maddening. So, we did get Anna first. This was on purpose so that she can start getting experience. Uh, the units I'm running, here's the units I'm running. Uh, we have Tank Man, he's very happy. He's happy and healthy, he's ready to be here. We have Anna, she's gonna be smacking someone with an ax, ideally, but she can also heal. Uh, you could probably drop Fram actually. Uh, maybe run Unica. Yeah, we could probably run Unica here. That'd be better. Or Eddie, whichever one you feel like. Uh, and then we're gonna run Horseman, Flying Horsewoman, and Alir, because it's forced. Alright, and then for positioning, I would say you want Luis here. You can just park him in the trees to prevent them from going in the trees. And then probably have Unica go in the trees as well. She's a covert, so just take these trees. Just steal the trees from them. And you do want to get to here before one of these, I think this guy runs down there and just destroys it randomly because he's, <laughs> even though he's corrupted, he still has impulses to destroy random friendly houses. Uh, and then for these guys up here, you do want to pick this mage. So you can have Chloe pop Sigurd, drive her horse on over and just kill it. And this guy, we'll figure it out as we go. Maybe I warp Ragnarok him. All right. So just save it, then fight. And make sure you have at least Fiorine at uh, donation level two or three for this so you get more crafting resources. Okay, so first things first. He tanks. And you can equip a javelin so that if the archer attacks him, which he will, he also tanks. And then she can go in here. She should be an avoid tank here, she should be fine. Yeah, they will not even be able to hit her. Her void is way too high, just sitting in trees. Simply moved into the trees. Okay, and then we can do. Power blooms in me. So we're gonna cut. We're gonna try to like break out here. Probably like here. Warp Ragnarok this guy. So start strong. And get some picks. Okay, and then pop Sigurd. This is going to be a lot of momentum damage, and if you have if you have a steel lance like I do, you'll be able to just completely destroy this thing. <laughs> In fact, you one-shot it with the first hit <laughs> from momentum. Alright, and then you can canter in. I'll let this hit me, and then we'll counterattack it. So, you want to pull enemies, you want to protect these little green units. Um, Alright, so Anna needs to start getting XP. He has high mobility, so I'm going to visit with him. His higher mobility. Defense tonic. Alright, that's not really that good, but we'll take it. It's free. If it's free, it's for me. Here goes. <laughs> I said that reluctantly. Alright, we'll go here. Let's check speed first. Alright, speed of 9. Let me see what my speed is with steel sword equipped. 9, perfect. Alright, so we're going to go here. Equip a steel sword. Chill out. I'm going to be making, a, like, a lot of use of enemy phase here. Alright. Yeah, so check it out. He's going to hit me, very likely. Ooh, he... Ah, oh, that's awesome. I get a kill for free. Yeah! I love when they agree with me. They, they agree so enthusiastically. They're like, yeah, yeah, yeah! They're very, they're very excited. They're excited enemies. They're here for me, you know? Louise is actually pretty insane. Not having a tank... On my main maddening run, I lost all my tanks. Well, my, I guess my Louise isn't dead. He's uh, low level. Looks like that doesn't want to fight me. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll kill that with Rider's Bane. Uh, but, yeah, not having a tank sucks. You want a tank? It definitely helps. And you might want to use boots on the tank to give him more movement. So these guys heal. So a few of them can get hit, but ideally you want to get... You know, as many things safe as possible. Alright, so we're gonna Riders Bane this. Killing him. If this love is a crime, Chloe is honestly S tier, to be honest. Like, it doesn't take much to get her to be insane. Um, moment, like, just getting her momentum, just putting Sigurd on her, and she becomes absolutely nuts. Uh, and if you don't put Sigurd on her, you can still just run a Steel Lance 
with this emblem and it just boosts the damage and as you upgrade the steel lance its weight goes down and then eventually she can double with it consistently around the mid game uh, but she'll double with it somewhat otherwise okay so we want anna to get kills which is going to be <laughs> difficult to achieve uh, because she's not very strong but i guess i can set up one this way Okay, we gotta set up Anna for success. Because she must be successful. We'll kill this guy. Time to finish the job. Time to finish the job. Wait, I didn't hire her. <laughs> She's just in my army. She just is like here. Alright, so we'll do a push here. Attack with Anna. I'm I'm trying to feed Anna kills to level her up as best I can. <laughs> <laughs> Her voice is hilarious. It sounds like it sounds like an adult woman trying to be as cute as humanly possible. <laughs> Alright, we'll give her axes for now because she can't test out of her base class. Alright, then we'll just kill this man. We're pretty tough, you know. I oh, I do know. Alright, we want to dive in. You want to dive in to save the one building? From Rude Boys. That's the guy. The guy that just moved there. That's the man. Alright, what does your Rider's Bane do here? Or your Poleaxe? Whoa! You're hitting a 26 there, kiddo. Holy crap. <laughs> she actually might pop off here. Alright, let's set this up for her. Hitting a 26? I'm proud of her. She can actually kill a thing. Only with this, though. We'll go for it. I can always pulse. She crits? Nice, dude. Alright, first level up for Anna. Get luck. Okay. It's fixed growth, so what are you gonna do? Okay, now we have to kill this guy. Which is not that difficult to do. Or maybe it is. Now I'll use Liberation. Liberation is a good sword because it's so light. You can upgrade it if you want to. I didn't I'm not in this run just to, to like mess with things, test things. I got a bit stronger. You did. Congratulations. Okay, and then these guys. Let's rotate. I'll easily be able to cut this off. He says an iron an iron bow. So I'm not too worried. Alright, and then you... Can just chill out here. Now, I can kill this now. I don't know that I need to. I might as well. We'll kill it now. We'll just kill it. Might as well. We're basically dominating the map. And Chloe's power leveling. Alright, she's starting to snowball a little bit. She's getting strength, some speed. Definitely worth investing in. Oh no, you're gonna hit me. <laughs> oh no. They really like smacking those villagers. They're obsessed with it. I can just tell. It's like their favorite thing to do. Oh, I can kill this too, holy crap. She's insane. She's like solo. She's like carrying the whole <laughs> north of the map, like northern section. And she crits. Insane. All right, we're gonna rotate you down. This guy, he might hit for some damage. We'll see. All right, I should use great sacrifice because it gives a lot of XP. And SP. Alright. It's also free. So you can't really go wrong. I live to serve. Okay, that mage might be a threat. So I'll kill this. Oh, 
The mage will kill Luis, so you want to get him out of there. Just kind of start pushing him up this way. It's fine. All right, Anna's down there. Unica can come down. He can hide in a tree. Then we'll easily kill those two. We actually want to get hit so that Anna can start healing, so that she can start leveling. Crazy enough, she can kill this. <laughs> she's insane. She's absolutely crazy. She's a really good unit. Her on fixed growth mode seems to be really solid. I actually prefer fixed growth now that I've used it a few times. It's actually pretty nice. Okay, and we do want to get the item, so we don't want to kill everything yet. Now, we do want to kill this guy, though. I'll hit him with Lodestar. Yeah, that kills him outright. He'll destroy that house. Friend, we shall not fall to the, enemy. <laughs> the echo. We shall not fall to the enemy. All right, we'll use heal. This one's probably the easiest paralog, to be honest. Oh, she healed herself with the AOE. That's funny. That's actually... Or no. Did she? I think she did. I guess you could restore yourself, too. Interesting. Alright. Probably want to kill that. Unica's level 9. Everyone's pretty much high level, so... I'll just start feeding a layer. Steel Sword I almost double with. Once I double with the Steel Sword, it's going to be way better than Liberation could ever dream of being. This time, victory was mine. That's right, this time. Victory was mine. Alright, then we visit the guy. Though I might do a farm here. Let's do a farm here. Let's visit. Thank you for There's not much I can do. Alright, that's a huge item. That's plus two damage on a physical. That's massive. So you want to get that, I would say. Alright, the then end. we're going to have Anna just spam heal. And I think I'm going to let one of my units get hit by that archer. Might as well turn this into an infinite farm of sorts. She heals- dude, that's so cool that she heals herself. I think she gets more XP from that too. So, you kill me. You do, actually. Okay, so that archer's a threat. So we can't let that happen. Now I have to get hit away from the green units. Because I think it'll just keep attacking the green units. Unless I attack it. Yeah, I might just mindlessly go after the green units. And the thing is, I can't heal them because the one guy heals them. Unless he doesn't heal them to full. Okay, he doesn't heal the archer's ones to full. So that actually is... Potentially huge. And then I can body block this archer in. With my unit, so it can't move. And we should have complete control over it. It's essentially mind control. Yeah, the reason why we don't want it to move is so that it can't shoot Anna. Because it might be able to kill Anna, so we don't want that. Yeah, and then we can heal it. Alright, this will work. Alright, so get you in there. We have to start getting these guys in there. The body block. I'll need... four units to completely surround it. So if you don't want to do this farm, uh, just kill that enemy. You know, just kill him. <laughs> also, keep in mind that this... Oh, okay, now he's healing. Oh, that sucks, actually. Now that he's healing. I think I can talk to him, though. Yeah, now that that guy's healing, I can't really heal it myself. Unless I can get him to move somehow. I need to get this kid out of here. I might be able to talk to him, though. We'll see.
And he also might not heal every turn. Okay, good. There's a healing threshold. That's perfect. Alright, so what is a healing threshold? It looks at their health and determines if it's going to heal them or not. <laughs> Alright, so we've surrounded this. And now it can't hit anywhere but here. <laughs> and we'll body block this tile. Oh, wrong unit. <laughs> Wait, where is Anna? There she is. Try to see. Alright, staff. Here we go. Heal the villager. Yes, this is perfect. This is the type of dumb crap we need. <laughs> this is perfect. Alright, so if you just want to kill the enemy, if you don't want to do this to power level Anna, you can just kill the enemy and then you're done. So thanks for checking this out. I'll see you in the next one. Also make sure to like and subscribe and drop a comment. Let me know what you think. And peace.